today in this tutorial i will show you how to convert a bearing from its degree minute second format to decimal format for example if you have this data line distance and bearing and uh, you can see the data here is degree minute second format but you want decimal format bearing so first of all you have to select the column where you have the data of degree minute second format bearing then you have to go to data menu here you can find the data menu and find the text to column option and before going to text to column you have to copy the degree symbol copy the degree symbol select the uh, column and go to text column then convert text to column wizard will appear then press the delimited button then next the other check only paste here your degree then it will be converted you can see the preview the degree is uh, converted here now finish you can see the degree separated after that you have to go you can repeat the method to separate the minute format go to text to column option go to delimited and in the other one you have to it is only single quotation see the preview this is also then you click finish and here uh, here is that option you can also go here or else you can just uh, replace the double quotation with space so you can do this like this also now finish otherwise uh, i'm just undoing it otherwise you can do like this replace replace find what find quotation and replace with nil this and replace all so you can do this like this also so now you have the de uh, degree degree need and the second for this uh, you have to write the formula like this is equal to then this is your degree so um, then in the plus sign uh, since uh, 60 minute equal to 1 degree so i we will divide it by 60 then plus the second 60 second equal to 1 minute and 60 minute equal to 1 degree so you have to divide this second to convert the second to degree by 3600 now enter now press enter so here it is double click here thank you guys see you in the next video in the next video i will show you how to import data if you have the distance and bearing only distance and bearing and uh, you want to prepare a map in autocad how will you do this so in this video uh, in the next video i will show this to you Keep watching our channel. Thank you for supporting. See you in the next video. Bye bye.